Mariscos Las Islitas food truck is on the corner of a busy intersection. But very little is known about what happened Saturday night when police had the area taped off as they tried to piece together why several men exited a car and started a fight with Acosta and other food truck employees. La verdad, si estoy un poquito asustada. The truth is that I'm a little scared because I always come here to eat. Yesenia Hernandez says she's been eating here for over a decade, but has learned to avoid the area at night, fearing situations just like this one. Me gustaría que... I wish there were more police coming through here, especially at night, because it's very dangerous around here. After Acosta was stabbed, police say the suspects got back into their car and left. Sadly, Acosta died from his injuries at the hospital. Without many answers, the community is on high alert. I think they should be a little more cautious. We have only been here about a month. Other food trucks in the area say they haven't had any issues. Yes, we're a little concerned, but the truth is that up to the month we have been here, it has been very safe. One woman we spoke with, who was too afraid to identify herself, says the hardest part is knowing they need to continue working. The truth is we all go out to work. I hope it doesn't happen to anyone else. It's really unfortunate. Es muy lamentable. We asked Phoenix police for an update on this case. They said due to the holiday today, they aren't able to provide any. Reporting in Phoenix, Alexis Dominguez for Arizona's Family.